Welcome to my YouTube channel, FK Tech. Today we will be looking at the Alfa Romeo Stelvio 2024. Charismatic styling, impressive agility, roaring turbocharged four-cylinder engine. But the relatively limited cargo space, cramped rear seats and larger infotainment screen would be nice. The Stelvio offers Julia-like excitement with the added utility of a crossover, with an emphasis on the former. Overview. Those who appreciate curb appeal and exciting driving dynamics will feel right at home behind the wheel of the charismatically stylish and impressively agile Alfa Romeo Stelvio crossover. Its balanced chassis is complemented by a powerful turbocharged four-cylinder that punches above its weight in what feels more like a powerful V6. The intelligent 8-speed gearbox ensures smooth engine operation and quick shifting. Rear-wheel drive is standard on Sprint models, while all other models have all-wheel drive. We appreciate the Stelvio's design and performance, but feel it lacks luxury and utility. Compared to rivals like the more affordable Genesis GV70, cabin materials are less up to par, and the 8.8-inch infotainment screen looks dated. What's new in 2024? For 2024, the Stelvio will get a new 12.3-inch digital instrument panel that can be set up in three different configurations, evolution, relaxed and traditional. Alpha made minor adjustments to the front fascia, including repositioning the logo and revising the two lower air ducts. The Italian crossover also gets cool new headlights with LED matrix technology and 3 plus 3 accent lights, giving the Stelvio the same light signature as the new, smaller tunnel. The taillights have also been updated with rearranged LED elements. Alpha also showed off a new Competizion model, but didn't say if it would make it to the US market. We think the Stelvio T is just right for you. It comes standard with all-wheel drive, an extra cost option on the entry-level Sprint trim. T adds desirable standard features, including larger 19-inch wheels, built-in navigation, a sunroof, and other available options. Most paint colors cost extra and different wheel designs are available. We'd stick with the standard wheel and go for the performance package, aluminum shifters, limited slip differential, and the premium package, 14-speaker Harman Kardon stereo, leather dash, and top doors. Engine, transmission and performance. The Stelvio's turbocharged four-cylinder engine delivers a powerful 280 horsepower through an 8-speed automatic transmission. The engine was effortlessly quick in our test and daily drive, and we particularly liked its responsive throttle and smooth power delivery. Its raspy exhaust sounded hot enough to use. Those looking for more excitement should look to the high-performance Quadrifoglio, which we review separately. Rear-wheel drive is standard on models, but all-wheel drive is optional and standard on other models. Towing capacity is 3,000 pounds. In addition to the dynamic powertrain, the Stelvio boasts sporty handling and compliance. The version we tested had 20-inch wheels, but provided adequate isolation on all but the heaviest bumps. While its maximum cornering grip is similar to its rivals, when it comes to driving engagement, the Alpha is the leader. The chassis, which is shared with the Julia sedan, has calm and comfortable damping. While the Stelvio's steering isn't as sharp as the Julia's, it's still light and responsive, especially for a crossover. Fuel Economy and True MPG While the Stelvio's actual fuel economy and highway mileage are remarkable, they're on par with four-cylinder rivals. The EPA has not yet released estimates for the 2024 model year, but we expect the numbers to remain the same. For 2023, rear-wheel drive models get 22 miles per gallon city and 29 highway. Adding all-wheel drive drops the highway rating by 1 mile per gallon. The Stelvio, which we drove on a 75 MPH highway fuel economy route as part of our extensive testing regime, returned 26 miles per gallon. Competitors like the X3 and Lexus RX are more frugal. For more information on the Stelvio's fuel economy, visit the EPA website. Interior, Comfort and Cargo Like the Julia sedan, the Stelvio offers a stylish interior and a comfortable driving position. Sportier models can be purchased with carbon fiber trim, while those looking for a more exclusive look can opt for wood inlays. 
the supportive front seats are wrapped in leather, and there are nice aluminum details on the dashboard, doors, and center console. The Stelvio has some useful storage tricks up its Italian sleeve, but with a small trunk behind the rear seat, it's not the roomiest crossover in the bunch. While other Alpha cabins have mediocre capacity, we appreciated the useful smartphone slot between the cup holders and the pad by the driver's left knee. There's also a clever removable tray at the bottom of the center console. Infotainment System and Connectivity For 2024, the Stelvio will get a new 12.3-inch digital instrument panel that can be set up in three different configurations, Evolution, Relaxed and Traditional. The infotainment system is still only one size 8.8 inches and responds to touch input, as well as a convenient rotary control in the center console as a redundant control. Built-in navigation, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are standard. We found the infotainment system to be visually appealing, but navigation alerts sometimes appeared too late, resulting in missed turns. Navigating using one of the two standard smartphone integrated interfaces solves this minor problem. Safety and driver assistance features. The Italian crossover has many standard driver assistance systems. Key security features include standard forward collision warning and automatic emergency braking, standard adaptive cruise control, standard blind spot monitoring, warranty and maintenance coverage. Despite the company's reputation for reliability issues, Alfa Romeo offers average warranty coverage for the Stelvio. The limited warranty covers 4 years or 50,000 miles. Powertrain warranty for 4 years or 50,000 miles. Free maintenance is valid for 1 year or 10,000 miles. Don't forget to subscribe so as to support the Chanel.